All right, what's going on? As you can see, I'm a little fogged in right now. It was actually a lot worse than this about half hour ago. Pretty much got here at sunrise and couldn't launch until like almost two hours later just because of how thick this fog was. It's pretty annoying. Still a little too thick where I do not want to go far out right now. So what I'm going to do is kind of hang close to the shoreline, drop some crabs down and see if I can get some tog. Wait for this fog to burn off and once it burns off, then I'll head a little further out and try and pick up some stripers. So, see how this day turns out. European green crab, actually an invasive species, believe it or not. That and Asian crabs are invasive, but they've been here for so long and they're so numerous that they're, they've almost become like a native species. But technically the blue crab is, our, is Rhode Island's native crab species, European and Asian both being invasive. But like I said, they're everywhere. You flip over a rock, what are you going to see? You're going to see a ton of Asian crabs and some green crabs. Fish busting, fish busting, right? Holy, I think that was an Albie, guys. Something just busted right there. Something's busting. Where's my epoxy jig? Thank God, it's right where it should be. Just saw a big splash right in front of me. These seagulls are circling around. Something just busted. It's like a shot of adrenaline right there, man. Holy crap. I need whatever that was to show up again. Just saw one splash. I could not tell what that was. But these birds are definitely circling around. I want to get a little closer before I start whipping cats. That was one quick splash. I really have no idea what that was. Oh, oh, right there, right there, right to my left, right to my left. Nervous water. I have no idea what this is yet, but there's something around me. Uh-oh, and there's birds picking it. Uh-oh, this might be a crazy morning. This might be a crazy morning. We got birds picking at bait in like three different spots. I've already seen a splash. It was definitely nervous for water right to my left. I think something's gonna pop off. Right to my left, fish were just busting. I still can't tell what these are, dude. They're up for like a second, so I think these might be albacore to be honest. Come on, come on, baby. I have no idea what these fish are. <laughs> Finally hooked up to whatever this is. I have no idea what this is. It does not feel like an Albi. Unless it just doesn't know it's hooked. Cause it's coming in pretty easy. I have absolutely no idea what this is. Feels like it's got a little weight to it. What the hell is this? It might be like a little alby. Oh, it's a big blue. Well, I don't know, man. Maybe I was wrong about what kind of fish we're breaking this morning. I could have swore I saw Albies, but it's pretty big blue. Oh, whoa. Just, ah. Uh, ah, oh, I just disconnected my transducer. <laughs> what a fail. Uh, well, finally caught something, man, a blue fish, but I don't know, this is a weird, weird day of fishing. Can't really figure out what's going on right now. Ooh, water's getting a little cold. Yeah, like I said, man, this is really weird. There's like a ton of seagulls picking at bait, but I'm not really seeing too much uh, surface activity, like fish splashing and stuff like that. It's all been like very sporadic, the fish that come up and are splashing, which made me think they were albies, but I mean, I just saw a quick splash through into it and then got a blue fish, so I, I don't really know what's going on here, man. It's a really weird little scenario. 
hooked up. Feels like a bluefish. Y'all are gonna get serenaded by Guns N' Roses right now. This feels like a really weird fighting fish. I'm gonna guess bluefish. What have we got? Yep, another little blue. Ah. This might just be a little bluefish blitz going on. Yeah, look how fat this little snapper blue is, dude. Holy crap, it's got a belly on it. These things have been eating really good. There's just gotta be a crap ton of bait in the area. Please. Second fish, the small little bluefish with a whole oh, big splash behind me. Enough talking. They were right behind me. Literally right behind me. Doing over the shoulder. See if I can get lucky here. I'm starting to hear a lot. Oh, right there. Hooked up. I just saw something swim and crush that. This feels like another blue. It's turned to a bluefish blitz. That guy's freaking out. Yeah, another blue. Hey buddy, this isn't gonna be fun. He just threw up a ton of, I don't know if you can see it, floating ton of sand eels. So I know what they're eating. Well, well, it seems there's a ton of bait around and it seems like there's a good amount of bluefish that found them. What I thought what was happening this morning was I was seeing very sporadic splashes, like one splash every five minutes. So I was kind of convinced they were albies. I didn't get a good look at them. So I was just kind of chasing those, you know, onesie twosie splashes and trolling around. And then finally I hooked up with a bluefish and it seems like since that bluefish, these fish have shown themselves a lot more often. There's way more blow ups now happening. I think I just, yeah, right to my left. There's one right there. I just think these are all bluefish to be honest. But I mean, I'm, I'm on fish. So I, I, I guess beggars can't be choosers, but I would much rather see a striper blitz. Oh, yeah, right there. Oh, wow. My fish got some air. That looked like a blue. Hooked up. I think this is a bigger blue. I saw it jump out of the water. They can't resist the SP minnow. Yeah, I think this blue's got a little weight weight to her. It's definitely a bigger one. I gotta switch to a single hook lure if these are just gonna be all bluefish. That is uh what is that? Oh, that's a striper! <laughs> Look at that! Hey, bud. You're a welcome sight during this bluefish blitz. Hey. Alright. Not a bad little fish. That's almost it's about a keeper size strip bass right there. Just gotta be careful with these treble hooks. See? Yeah, I don't wanna get one in the hand. Hey, bud. There we go. Hooked him pretty good.
a little stripe right here about a, I don't know, 26 inch fish, really healthy looking guy. A welcome sight, I thought it was just bluefish in this action, so. Let's see what else we can get, we got a mixed bag right now. Oh, come on buddy, I was trying to revive him, I lost my grip, oh, there he goes.